much of the work on language acquisition and speech perception in particular um, and, and the way that babies develop focuses on the auditory information that's coming in. Um, and one of the things that this work shows is that infants are actually using other forms of information that are available to them, and that's in the articulators that they're using in the oral motor gestures. Da! Da! The way that this study was done is that we gave infants uh, teething toys that either prevented their tongue from moving um, or allowed their tongue to move. and asked whether under those two conditions they could equally well discriminate two sounds, two different D sounds, um, that um, differ in where you place your tongue. And what we found is that when the baby had the teething toy in its mouth that interfered with tongue movement, that they no longer discriminated these two D sounds that are used in Hindi, but not in English. But when they had the other teether toy in their mouth, they could still discriminate these sounds. So what this does is it brings into question um, existing theories of, of speech perception and language acquisition. And it, it asks, should we be paying attention to other um, sensory systems? And do those play a role in how babies acquire language? And from these results, we think that they do. Are our teething toys, our soothers, impeding speech perception development in some way? At this point, we don't have evidence to suggest that, and I don't think that parents should be concerned about the use of these kinds of toys. But the question remains, how much experience do they need without any kinds of teething toys or soothers or thumb-sucking behavior? Not every baby is able to move their articulators equally well if they have some kind of oral facial dysmorphology, if they have cleft palate, if they have um, an illness that makes them have to have a ventilator in their mouth for a long period of time, um, um, things like that. And so understanding whether this is an important part of speech perception and language development is a really important question.